Okay, guys, what we have left is just like bits and bobs. So I'm just going to reach down in it, kind of pick up a handful and sort it out as we go. Because uh, I don't want to reach down in there. Just pick up one at a time. Oh, that's a pretty dragonfly. Looks like it's got mother of pearl wings. The rhinestones there on its other wings are in there. And then it's got two rhinestones for eyes. So that's nice. Oh, I've had, I have one like this, but it's I think it's silver. It's a wreath. This one is not marked. Broke. E. Ten. That is. What is that? What bird is that? I don't know. It's a pin, though. Okay. Some clip-on earrings. We'll set them over there. We'll find the other one. Oh, here's the match. That one clip-on earring. So that's good. There's a match over there. Actually, it's right over here. If I can get it together. No, it's not. That isn't the match. Never mind. We'll set it goes over there. A gold tone. Very shiny gold tone. Um, bracelet. It's nice. A screw back earring. Ooh, another um, cameo. And it looks like it's signed. Let's see if it is. It is. It is Coro. Oh, did I show that to you? I was looking at the other part. Say Coro. I think you can see it. There we go. Let's put that down. Hopefully find that one. Like I said, a lot of people like their uh, cameos. Oh, what is this? What is that? A clip on earring that's just heavily tarnished. I'm trying to get to you guys and see it. Is that a cross up there? Or is that a. You'd wear it like that, or is it like a totem? I don't know. Totem pole thing. It's really, really tarnished. Oh, my arm's hurt. A little clip on. Almost looks like an egg clip on. Egg. Oops, dropped you. Move you back, move you back, gotta move you back. Uh, a D pin. These are cufflinks that are cars. Like old 19, what we say, 30s, 20s racing cars. They're really in rough shape, but they don't appear to be signed. I'm looking, you guys can't see. They look like they might have been signed, but it's like it's like off of there. It's a little pin. Nope, it's not a pin. It's a clip-on earring. It's pretty. The other toy finds its mate. Uh, then we have a bracelet, silver tone. Where's the link? It's like links. Does not appear to be marked. Let me put it over here. It's not sticking to my magnet over there, so hmm. who knows? Another pin. I'm tied in a little knot. Ooh, fancy. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Look at that prettiness. That clip on earring. And it is marked on the back. Let's see what it says. It says West Germany. I can see from here. Hey, my eyes might be getting better. See West Germany? Yeah, those I thought those would sell better when I got the West Germany ones, but they really I haven't had a real good time selling those. Got a lot of single earrings that I'm hoping we have the mates for. So I'm setting them down here below you where you can't see, but I will show them to you. This is a pin. What is that? Oh what is that symbol? I know what it is. It's a florally or whatever it's called in it that symbol they put a lot of the royalty uses it the house of tutors used it and stuff didn't they oh look what we got we couldn't get without a bag could we look uh-huh uh-huh uh -huh. i told you we'd get something always in there oh here's the other one to that one i still don't understand these 
if they're brass or copper or shoe clips maybe maybe they are shoe clips but I don't know what they are they almost look like well totem poles going ah screaming at you I'm putting this here guys I'm trying to I'll put it in front of you in just a second bear with me let's move this let's move our beautiful jewelry box out of the way oh here we go Oh, if I have space over here and clip, I'll make you guys wait. And let's put all this that I got out here down here so you guys can see it. Whoops. And see if we have any mates to this because I have a feeling yeah, we're not going to have mates even over in this. Okay. So we have an earring like this, and it is. No, it's not an earring. Sorry. It, you go through it, like put a chain through it. It's a pendant. I do believe it's Mark Sarah Coventry. Sorry, I'm down. No, it's Mark something else. Let's see. Can you see what it says? Marvello? Is that what it says? Marvello. M A R V E L L O or M A I V A? I've never heard of that. Put the pendant. I'll put that one up. This must go in this. I don't even think that's worth fixing because it's really, really cheap plastic. And tin. We have this cross. It's enamel. It is not signed. I have another bracelet like this. No, I have a, a necklace like this. This must match it. And it's got this like milk glass looking but it's not really milk glass it's a it's a um i don't know tell somebody tell me what that stone is is it moonstone I think it's moonstone but it is not broke and it is not signed and it's nice it's got all its links and everything to it now we have this red earring and it's very pretty and it's very intact and there is no not that i see any mate down here let me get you see you see a mate down here i don't Okay, we have a pen that says love silver tone Ooh, a pretty oh there's another one of those with the latch and then the lobster clasp um, bracelets not signed but pretty stones not sitting there with prongs so they're just put in there but they're pretty it's pretty I don't know if it, I, I knew I wouldn't get away from dropping it drop on every video okay I gotta, I gotta hurry up because oh did we find this one or was that one oh no that was the one that i had oh, sorry okay i got a lot of mismatch stuff down here here is a brooch there's just a ribbon this earring there is no match to it down here here's that egg earring we might have over there this has no mate to it there's the car one, but I had put that back down here. The cameo has no mate. A lot of it, there's, here is a pin. Then there's an angel, it's heavy. It is signed. It's upside down. Do not know what it's signed. Cannot pick it up on the thing. Hold on just a second. It's so wore off, I don't know what it's signed, but I'll look into that. Um, a button earring that is clip-on. That earring that's clip-on. Oh, screw back, I'm sorry, and clip-on. The cameo. Like I said, the car. Um, um, cuff link. All these don't have mates. Oh, that's a little cherub pin. Oh, I really wish I had the mate to that one. That one's pretty. So I have some single ones, which I'm kind of surprised because they said... They didn't mention that. They made it sound like everything was going to have a mate. Oh, that goes in that broken, broken um, earring we found. I said it was probably wasn't good enough to keep. There's a little pin of the dove. So, as you can see, we've got all that down there. Then little bits and bo Oh, and this here. That does not match anything. Has no mates. That one's broke. That, I don't know what this is. The broken that was a little squirrel <laughs> hey, look at that. 
a little squirreling and put it on a, on a pendant as a pendant. So we have all that. So anyway, guys, I did good, I think, for $9.99. I paid $15 and something for shipping. So I will see you guys again. I hope you enjoy this. Give me a thumbs up. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, please do so. Please give me a thumbs up. It helps people find my videos. I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for coming along with me. Uh, bye. Hi guys, Frugal Gal here. I just want to make this quick video. It will immediately follow the video um, of the jewelry box I bought one off of eBay on the auction. And after I did those videos, I sorted out all the jewelry. And so I'm going to show you guys because if you guys see anything on my videos that you want to buy, make me an offer. Tell me. I mean, I would sell this stuff to you really cheap. Because it saves me from having to take um, all the pictures and list it and things. I mean, I take pictures for you, but you know what I mean, editing and all that. So I'm just going to kind of quickly go over these piles just to show you how much I've got of different items. So I separated the bracelets and the earrings and then the mismatched onesies and the pins and things like that. So back here we have all of the, oops, sorry, I hit the, I hit the camera, all of the bracelets. So, any of those bracelets that you watch the video on and you see um, you'd like to buy, you'd like to buy the whole lot of these bracelets, just let me know. I'll cut you a really good deal. And then here, this is the amount of brooches that was in that jewelry box. So, a lot of nice brooches. And these are all the brooches that, um, I think this one is missing some of the rhinestone so I might put that to the side but the rest of them aren't they're all together then these is the piles of all those little pins stick pins we had so that's the pile of them then we had two sweater sweater clips the ones with the uh, oh, flowers and then the mustard seed inside the heart over here is pendants that would go on I'm gonna count this as a pendant because that you could have the chain but the chain's not really good the one that we opened up and it had this set in there and it's got a very strong hinge on it when you open it up which I can't now because I'm holding the tripod in my other hand it flops back on you really quick and I didn't notice and I don't know if it'll pick it up can you see that see that it's an angel a lady angel then with a cherub um, over there flying cherub shoot an arrow so it has have an engraved scene on it it's very heavy it's got that scent stuff still in it it's not marked it's engraved on the back too but not with a picture just regular well, I guess it's not engraved that's just a um, the texture of it. But that's very heavy. And these crosses, see that to me would all be, I would sell it together. I mean, if you wanted all that, I mean, three bucks. Three bucks and pay shipping. For them, the two cross pendants on a chain. One's on a chain, one's not. And then that, because it's got the uh, angel on it. And then, yeah, this pendant. Real glass. And this isn't really a pendant, but it could be made into a brooch or a pendant. And then, the, I don't know, I might have to keep the poodle. That is just too cute. And over here is my broken things. I've decided I'm going to fix these. Just take some glue to fix these. And then that one necklace needs the other attachment for it to grow together. The, what am I trying to say? The latch on the back is not a latch. What is it? A clasp. That's what I'm trying to think of. Okay, and then I got all these earrings here. Clip-on, screw-backs, pierced. A ton of earrings. Um, let's see. This is this got sorted out. It's just stuff that I really don't want. It's too dirty. It's yucky. This is going to be, I'm sorry, it's going to be thrown away. And these are the single. Single screw back earrings and clip-ons and some pierced. Well, one pierced I see. But some of these are marked. And there's that um, uh, cufflink, the racing car from like the 1930s. I mean, the car is the 1930s. It's not from the 1930s. And uh, this is swank. This one is swank. So I might save that and put it with some other swank ones I have. Put that over there. But these are all, some of these are marked West Germany. Some, a couple of them I know are marked Coro. So if you're into that, just taking the single things. I know a lot of people are very talented and they'll take the backs off of them and make something out of them. Um, if you guys don't, maybe I will. So that, I mean, I would sell that lot for like a buck. Actually, I'd probably give it to you if you want it. I just say you want it just show me a picture pay for the shipping and have it so if you guys um want any of these just ask me why i got the necklaces over here and i noticed that one necklace i thought might be real pearls that the whatever those darker pearls are called has a matching i don't know if i showed it on the video 
It has a matching bracelet too. So what are those? Because they are knotted, individually knotted in between them. What are the dark pearls called? I mean, I'll know it by the time you guys tell me because I'll look it up. These I don't believe are, even though they are knotted also in between them. So, But our, there's all the necklace. Remember that one I think was Monet. I think this one's the Monet one. And then you can see my little, look at that. Let's flamingo my water. Uh, and then that over there is going in a bead thing. You can have that for free too. I'll put it over. Oh, here, we'll put this over here with this. Because I never did figure out what these are. Because I got to thinking, I thought, well, maybe they go up and they clip on your ears. But they don't. Maybe somebody just put them together and didn't finish them. So we'll put them over there. Okay, I just want to make a short video to tell you guys. Remember, you could get these stuff cheap. Just let me know. I don't know when this video will be put up. But I definitely will not have this stuff up individually to sell. Because I got a lot more stuff to go through. And then my video after this one will be opening this jewelry jar. And I'm not sure when I'll get this done, guys. Because I... You guys might notice that when I do my videos, I have a scar right there. And if you're familiar with any of my other videos, I had my hand operate on. And I'm getting this one operated on this week. So I will be in a splint for a while. So no telling when I will open this up. It might be nice to just keep it for a while and and know it's always there. Because I won't be shopping for a while. So thanks guys for watching. Just let me know. Please leave comments. Thumbs up. Talk to me. I like getting comments and talking to you guys. I appreciate you. And I, I like everybody else's videos that they make. I've been watching a lot of new people. Um, uh, jewelry, unbagging and jarring and all that. So thanks guys. Thumbs up. See you later. Bye.